The Haikom Sun community maintains that the Sun are among the oldest inhabitants of Namibia, yet remain the poorest tribal groupings in the country. The Haikom Sun face numerous challenges, including landlessness and government not recognizing their traditional leadership. Gaub Willem Aib says he plans to raise their issues with the United Nations Human Rights Council and will demand their return of their ancestral land. We are having people that are concerned and are worried about our suffering in, uh, in Namibia. It is known that the government is not worrying with our laws, that government is violating our laws. It has been reported accordingly. You even don't know. There is a day which is coming that government can also easily be taken to court. Cultural survival uh, 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 job is to taking the, court, uh, the, the, the government that has dispossessed the lands of indigenous peoples. I called on the Haikom Sun community to consider a political party that would represent them in parliament as indigenous people and not just as a marginalized group. During the Haikom Sun Burning Issues Conference, the group looked at ways to become relevant in terms of Namibia's governing systems. Everything is possible if we stand together. Differences will be there as long as we are human beings. But this cannot stop us to come together on the issues that affect us all. I must call upon everyone who considers himself or herself as a leader to plant a seed of unity amongst their followers. Some tribal leaders under the Haikom Sun have distanced themselves from the Burning Issues Conference. Haikom Sun Burning Issues was formed last January due to concerns raised within the community and aims to address these accordingly. The National Youth Council was also represented at the conference.